was a media event, and it did rain on our parade. Nonetheless, a busload of reporters and cameramen descended on the Connolly Ranch, which does have, after all, a rich history of backroom politics. But this was front room showmanship. John and Nellie Connolly put on their best brand of the Ritz for Republican workforces from 19 states. Ray Hutchison maintained to the end that this was a nuts and bolts congressional campaign meeting. But the media came for bigger game than that. They pressed Connolly on his presidential prospects. He said he doesn't have any. I don't know. I don't want to ever say that I'll refuse to serve uh, my party or my country. I'm simply saying to you that I'm not a candidate for anything. I don't expect anything. Uh, I don't anticipate anything, either uh, as an elected official or an appointed official. Major John Connolly has a problem with his new party, uh, and he knows it. Reconsider, but frankly, I don't have that much support in the Republican Party. Uh, uh, I, uh, you know, I'm a newcomer, uh, and this is one of the changes that we're going to have to make in the Republican Party. They don't exactly greet us with open arms. The Lord must love a media event. Because the rain stopped and the sun came out, just in time for television reporters to do their stand-ups outside. Most of them talked about a Ford Connolly ticket. But that seemed just as remote from political reality as the Connolly Ranch is now from political power. What the place and the man...